Well, hi everybody, my name is J.R. Simmons. Uh, what I'm hoping to do here is as I construct this wooden model ship uh, that I've bought, I'm going to try to make a series of videos uh, to kind of show the, the trials and tribulations as I go through it. I've only seen one other guy do this, a guy by the name of Gary Brinker, and I watched a lot of his videos. And I've only made one wooden model ship before, and it was years and years ago. I uh, made a lot of mistakes because I was very young and very impatient. And hopefully this time around, I made it go a little bit better, and I thought, uh, you know, it might be good to put it out there kind of like he did and, and kind of show everybody uh, what I do and, and kind of get some tips and, and stuff like that. So uh, just a couple things. I mean, one, I'm not an expert. I've got one whole whopping ship of experience here, and it didn't turn out real good. And so what uh, I decided to do to get back into this was to build the same ship. So the one uh, we're going to attempt to do again here, I've got it right here, is uh, it's a kit by Constructo, uh, and it's called uh, the Union. And so I'll hold it up here a little bit. And so this, this ship I tried to do once before, and like I said, it didn't turn out real good. But uh, we'll give it a shot and, and kind of see how this goes. So uh, if anybody actually ever watches this and uh, you've got a lot more experience than I do or you see something I did and you're like, how'd you do that? Then, uh, you know, I'll be more than happy to, to try to get a reply back to you. And uh, if you got any tips for me and whatnot, that, that would be great. So uh, I'm going to go ahead and uh, unbox some things, reposition my, my video camera here, and, and we'll go from there. Okay, I'm gonna have to hold the camera up here. I'm gonna have to go out and buy me a tripod. But uh, anyway, uh, when you first open the box here of the Union, you get uh, these nice picture uh, diagrams that uh, supposedly will help you out a little bit. Uh, the kit itself here, you have, uh, obviously it's a, it's a pre-shaped hull. Uh, you got some paint for it and whatnot, they send you a couple tools, and then you have all the, uh, all the stuff, uh, you know, that you need to go ahead and build this thing. So the parts that you get, uh, with this ship, you can see a lot of the rigging thread and and some of the things there. Uh, you got the you got the hole out, and then you got your sails right here. On the last ship I tried to do, I didn't even put the sails on it, so I'll have to determine that. That's your mounting base plate, uh, from what I remember. Uh, going into the box, these are you know your masts and and some other things and bits and pieces of the parts, the brass fittings, wire. Uh, and all that stuff. So I remember in doing this there was two things that, that was just an absolute pain in the butt and one was the fact that it's a 1 to 100 scale so you're dealing with very 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 small parts and that's not always exactly easy. So um, we'll just have to kind of see how it goes. The one good thing I did save my plans off the old ship so I've got them over here and uh, that way, these things I remember were, were the best guide to, to try to build this. The instruction book uh, that you get right here, there's only two pages basically that uh, deal with how to build this thing because it's in about 15 different languages and the only one I read is English. So uh, I remember using this a little bit, but then mostly uh, going over here and, and using the set of plans. So. Okay, so instruction number one tells you to sand the entire hull. So we'll take that, uh, go over it here with, uh, with sandpaper and, and get him smoothed down as best we can. I do remember from uh, the first kit, you know, you have a lot of uh, imperfect uh, places on it, a lot of imperfections on it. And so unless uh, I really want to get into it and fill it with putty and some other things, yeah, I don't know. You know, so uh, the other boat that I had, I painted it, and I may do that again with this one, but just have to kind of make the decision when we get a little further down the line here. So uh, we'll go ahead and sand this thing up, and then we'll bring it back uh, with the camera here and, and kind of show you show you okay, what. So uh, I got the hole sanded down here, so it's uh, it's about as good as I can possibly get it. So what I did was use 100 grit sandpaper. Uh, you probably even use 80. Uh, to sand the whole thing and then brush it off or if you got a little air nozzle on a air tank or something and then take about 220 go back over it smooth it out real nice and good and uh, that's about as good as, as it's going to get right there um, and looking at the plans 
says the next thing is to draw some lines you know up here on the uh, on the deck so what they're wanting to do there is simulate the planking uh, because there's no planking involved in this ship and so I think what I'm gonna do is I, I'm gonna wait on that for a little bit and just go ahead with uh, the next couple steps here and then come back to the uh, the planking at a at a different time or the simulated planking at a different time so uh, as of right now we got the hole sanded uh, it's ready to go uh, for the next little step here and we'll the just next instruction says that you need to drill some holes that are dead center on the uh, the deck of the ship and so what I did uh, took my uh, caliper tool here and measured out on uh, a couple places on the ship to where you end up you know finding the center line so uh, what I did you probably see it on here uh, just drew a line right down the center and so the next instruction uh, says to drill this hole 130 millimeters from the stern and so uh, go ahead and get that and then uh, mark that off and then we'll it says drill a uh, similar hole 93 millimeters from the first hole so that would be 223 millimeters from the stern so uh, I'll mark those off and then uh, kind of show you what I did there and then we'll go ahead and uh, put it in my drill press here and, and go ahead and drill kind of turn it around here and uh, show you what I'm what I'm using um, I've got a uh, I've got a drill press here uh, this little five-speed wind and uh, I've got my bit in there and then we'll go ahead and we'll we'll drill it uh, we'll drill it using that okay so uh, went ahead and got the two holes drilled to put the mass in and then uh, I went ahead and planked the deck uh, with the pencil so you can kind of see what I did I mean I'm not I'm not so sure it looks good or it looks bad or or in between but I mean we'll we'll give it a shot and we'll we'll try it and see how it goes here so um, the other thing is the next part they tell you to do is to take uh, the stern post which is this little bitty piece and then fit it uh, into the the back of the hole here now when I when I first uh, took a look at it and got it on here it wasn't near that flush and so I had to do a little bit of sanding up here a little bit of sanding down here and even sand it on to here uh, to make this thing get flush and so uh, going forward uh, we'll go ahead and probably See if we can get that thing on there and then uh, go ahead and conclude video one here and then start working on the uh, the bulwarks and, and some other things to, uh, for the next video. So, okay.